guys welcome to my channel thank you very much for clicking onto this video please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share this video and when you're done please check out the rest of my videos your support and love is highly appreciated the podcast I made G has called Caspanyo Vest fake. This is after Caspanyo Vest promised that he will come to the podcast if he loses his fight with Nag Music. He then later on went on to fight Nag Music and he lost the match. After that, Caspanyo Vest wanted a rematch, but it looked like Nag Music was not interested and that rematch never took place. So Caspanyo Vest lost that match and he has not shown up at the podcast. And this is why McG went out to call him fake on his latest episode. He then took it one step further and said that Caspanyo Vest does not own Biliardo. Now, if you don't know what Biliardo is, it is an alcoholic drink that is owned by Caspanyo Vest. At least as far as we know, McG insists that Caspanyo Vest does not own the brand and that somebody else actually owns the brand. And I guess he's pushing the narrative that Caspar is somehow a poster boy for the brand. He does not own the brand. He did not mention who owns this brand, but he is very much convinced that Caspanyo Vest does not own it. So it would have definitely been interesting to hear who really owns this Biliardo brand and you know names as well as receipts being dropped would have definitely been interesting but it looks like McG is holding that information very close to his chest or maybe he does not know. He continued to say that he respects Caspanyo Vest and everything that he has done for the industry, the music and all but he just hate the fakeness that he brings. Anyway, tell me what do you think? Do you think that indeed Caspanyo Vest does not own Biliardo or do you think that McG is just reaching? While you're at it, please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and share this video and I will see you next time. Bye!